the queen of soul, it's Morgan Webb. Welcome back to X-Play. Now, card battle games teach us all important lessons, like no matter how hard you prepare, life is always random. And in order to be the best, you have to pay a lot of money or whine at your mom until she pays a lot of money. But to further these lessons, here's our review of Yu-Gi-Oh! GX here at College. Some people find safety in retreating into tedium of daily life. Draw phase, main phase one, battle phase, meta phase, anaphase, telephase, and that phase in your life that makes you want to scream. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Spirit Caller for the GS revels in the monotony with the same graphics as last year, but with an added twist that might just save the franchise. And with every new Yu-Gi-Oh! game, we like to bring out our gang of experts, the Yu-Gi-Oh! game. Uh, what happened to the Yu-Gi-Oh! gang? An excellent question indeed. As you know, the gang is now defunct. No more Yu-Gi-Oh! gang? But why? Yu-Gi-Oh! games, as Euclidians say, suck. Some needed to find new creative outlets. Wolverine! He's the best at what he does, and he's doing it on the card! This is awesome! I, on the other hand, have returned to my cultural roots, so please continue your review and do so without us. Wow. I thought you had to read Beckett to find yourself neck deep in, uh, never mind. There are only two new aspects of this card game. Spirit Caller introduces, what else? Spirits to moderately help you, but often hinder your progress by forcing you to use cards you don't want in the first place. And there's, well, why don't we let the often overlooked and newest member of the Yu-Gi-Oh! gang handle this one. Hi, Morgan! Yes, Billy, the Pokemon lover who found his way into the gang, one severe beating at a time. Billy, why don't you tell us about the multiplayer mode? Of course I would! Multiplayer lets you link up with another person to duel. Unlike previous games, you can now play people over the internet, either by their personal code or through a match system. You level up by winning, so no one knows how many games you've lost, only how many you've won. Fascinating, Billy. Sounds like a game that really brings together the fans, like a community or a town. A town? I've always said that the Yu-Gi-Oh! gang is kind of like a town. Like, like Pallet Town over in Pokemon. You know, with uh, Professor Ash and uh, Misty and... Nah, dog, you're wrong. No, what kind of town is it? This is Yu-Gi-Oh! Town! <laughs> is this the part where you beat me up? Ah, yes, the sun is shining, the birds are singing, and Yu-Gi-Oh! games still kind of suck. But with Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Spirit Caller, there's hope for a brighter, more connected future with online play. And that's why we're giving this game three random gang members out of five. I was actually an internationally decorated Yu-Gi-Oh! champ in the 90s. He said he could go all the way. And this damn wrist of mine gave out and I had to go into early retirement. He lost all of his frozen burrito endorsements. It's really a tragic story. It is! In a moment, Rogue Galaxy on X-Play. 